And so no one wants to battle cancer, but once faced with what can be a long road to recovery, it helps to have access to the best support available. Melissa Klein is the Radiation Therapy Manager at Bismarck Cancer Center. Melissa, thank you for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. Thanks for being here, Melissa. So we want to hear all about yourself, what you do at the Bismarck Cancer Center, and your role. Okay. Um, like you said, my name is Melissa Klein. I am the Radiation Therapy Manager, so I am in charge of the girls who, I say I always say girls, because I've got a great crew um, that deliver the radiation treatments to patients on a daily basis. Okay. And we had shown our viewers a picture of a great machine you guys have now. Yeah. Can you tell us about the new machine Bismarck Cancer Center just got? Yeah. So we got our third Versa HD. It's an Electa treatment machine, so that's our vendor is Electa. Um, it is state of the art and so we're very excited um, it matches our other two machines that we installed through our expansion and um, it provides you know state of the art treatment to our patients um, our treatment machines before were very advanced and we've been very fortunate to be able to keep up with technology but this um, new treatment machine it allows us a couple of energies that are able to deliver treatments very fast and so with our special procedures that we do time is of the essence and so we don't want patients to be moving so that delivery speed really helps us stay nice and accurate mm -hmm. um, it also has a couple different features with our couch top that's what the patients lay on for treatment we call it our couch um, before we were able to just account for our up and down left and right and in and out shifts um, this new table allows us to accommodate for pitch yaw and roll which is you know, your hips might be a little bit farther to the left today, so we can get you lined up to the millimeter as oh, what wow. they plan to be. And so does that just help with the radiation going to a very specific place? Absolutely, yep. And so our this technology, as our technology advances, um, our doctors are able to pinpoint pinpoint closer and closer and so um, the treatment areas have gotten smaller which means um, higher doses smaller areas of treatment but also less um, normal tissue being treated and so the more accurate that is the more accurate we have to be and so these table shifts allowing that um, rotation in those different um, translations really help that. Yeah, sounds like a great addition. And you yeah. mentioned a matching machine to some of your existing machinery. Yeah. Can you talk about the importance of that? Yeah, and so, you know, we added an expansion the last few years, and we've been able to add on a third treatment machine. And so then we've replaced now. This was the second replacement. And so all three machines match. Um, we treat patients from about a 250-mile radius around Bismarck down into South Dakota, Montana. Um, you have to have treatments on... A daily basis um, and so before all of our machines when they didn't match if one of them went down we would have to cancel patients because um, our service comes from a ways away sometimes they have to order parts and so if you can't have that treatment you don't get to just miss it you have to make it up so when you're coming from Dickinson every day having to add on that extra day really can um, make difference and so we um, just work really hard to accommodate schedules too. And so when patients are coming, if we have issues on one machine um, or we're running late, we can bounce patients back and forth and just keep the clinic flow and accommodate patients' times better because anybody can go on any machine. Mm. So helpful. Now, we also wanna mention with the expansion that you referenced, what are some highlights that you're really enjoying from this expansion, which you said this is kind of the last piece of that. Yeah. So. We're, you know, going from two machines to three machines has been huge for everyone, um, for staff and patients alike. Before, when we had two machines, we were really busy, and so we would have to treat early, we'd have to treat late, we'd have to treat through lunch, and we wouldn't have any room for hiccups, and so we'd be running late. Um, and so by having the three machines, it just gives us more capacity for patients. And with them matching, like I said, any patient on any treatment, um, so it just really has made our hours for our patients a lot better. It's given us expanded time for those patients, so you have time to visit a little bit and not just um, do a treatment. It's also um, expanded our exam room capability and so for our nursing staff and all the patients coming for um, consults and follow-ups, um, it just has made that flow better as well. So. And Melissa, what else does Bismarck Cancer Center have going on that you want our viewers and everyone uh, to, to know about? Well, you know, we have tremendous community support for our foundation. And so um, we've got a lot of events going on. We've got um, Drive to Survive. We've got Apple Fest coming up in the fall mm -hmm. we're already planning for. So we have all sorts of community events going on. Um, and 
the money raised for those events goes right back to our um, foundation services and they've all been able to move into new spaces with our expansion and have extra room and um, space to visit with patients and so just got a lot going on all the time. Yeah. And yeah. what are some of the things that the foundation covers? Mm. So our foundation, um, it started with a social worker and so um, we provide services like social work, dietary care, um, physical therapy, evaluations, um, massage therapy, transportation, lodging, and all of those things, especially those services like um, dietary, patients might have to decide if they wanna pay for that or have it go through insurance and they might decide not to, but it's really important to them. So that's where the foundation comes in and all of those services are covered for patients. Um, and so massage therapy is another thing too. Um, people have to lay on our hard table, that couch top I was saying, and um, it's just, very stressful to know you have to hold still during that treatment and so being able to have that massage just has really taken the edge off for people and we hear that all the time even sometimes we have to say it to some of our older <laughs> populations like oh just try it and they come back after trying it once and they're like oh my gosh that was amazing and so all those stories when you um, see it going right back to the patients on a daily basis makes it all worthwhile all the all the events and the time put in so well, you guys are doing great work. Thank you so much, yeah. Melissa. Thanks, Thanks for having me. And for more information, make sure you go to BismarckCancerCenter.com.